Welcome to Revit Content and the All-in-One Revit Kitchen Family 3.2. The All-in-One Revit Kitchen Family allows you to create any kind of kitchen unit with just one single advanced parametric Revit family. The previous version of the All-in-One Revit Kitchen Family just allowed you to set up a corner unit with a door panel on each side as illustrated. The new version 3.2 allows you now to set up any corner unit for your specific project independently of each side configuration. We start with a standard single floor unit which comes within the included type catalog file as a single floor unit. First we duplicate this single unit and name it for example new corner unit to keep the original setup for the single unit. Next, we adjust the new corner unit in its width to a double unit, which is in this example 1200 mm. Next, we copy this unit for the second part, which will adjust to fit at 90 degrees to this new corner unit as set up earlier. Next we change the type of the copied unit back to a single floor unit which we will then rotate 90 degrees. Having done this step we now have both units that will be further adjusted to form finally the customized kitchen corner unit. For the corner unit we adjust the fixed panel that will then finally host the other unit. We enable the fixed panel by activating the type parameter fixed panel and adjusting the type parameter fixed panel offset to the width required. The width of this fixed panel should be more than the depth of the joining unit and can form a visible post to give the required space to the door. Next we move the single unit towards the corner unit and align the back so that it forms one line with the corner unit. Looking at the 3D view we can see that we need to amend the worktop front profile to abut the single unit to the corner unit. We do this in adjusting the type parameter top profile offset right as we want to abut the single unit at the right side of the corner unit. The corner unit is now ready to be joined with the single unit. To abut the single unit to the corner unit, we simply align the single unit with the corner unit and lock them together. Now you can see how simple it is to assemble a customized corner unit out of any single all-in-one kitchen unit. To finalize the last details we need now to adjust the kick plate as well as the backsplash. We do this in adjusting the type parameter kick plate offset left for the single unit to a value that represents the setback of the kick plate for the corner unit. Finally, we need to adjust the backsplash of the single unit to abut the backsplash of the corner unit. We do this in adjusting the type parameter backsplash offset left for the single unit to a value of the distance between these two backsplash. As you can see, I have kept a small gap between the two backsplashes as you would do for a silicon filling.
As a result, you can now see a customized corner unit consisting of two glazed door panels. If you would like to learn more about this amazing all-in-one Revit kitchen family or other advanced parametric families of the all-in-one Revit family series, visit us online at www.revit-content.com. We hope that this video tutorial has helped you to understand how simple and effective this all-in-one Revit kitchen family functions and we hope that this will add real value for you and make your Revit projects more efficient.